No Money Spent, episode 3. So starting this episode off, this is our top 5 and we're at 79 overall. Now we do have 3 unopened packs to get into, one of them being the Jalen Ramsey upgrade token, which this token right here will allow us to upgrade him to an 85 overall. So that is a huge upgrade token for us, but now we're getting into the red zone pack. Starting this off with a 71, 76 Irv Smith, not bad, 73 Duke Johnson, and then a 78 Devon Witherspoon. Okay, I wonder if this goes for anything like 4,000 coins? That's a nice Solid card to pull and finally we're getting into our maxed fantasy pack i mean i'm hoping that we can at least pull an elite or like an 84 overall headliner player that would be insane or a legends player and then we get a 77 Dion jackson okay that's one of the new headliner players that we could get but starting off our second round starting this one off with a gold two golds three golds and oh my gosh an all gold pack i guess we're gonna take the 75 76 and then the 74 left guard and i guess while we're opening up packs we do have our daily get a gold pack and on my main account i actually got an elite so i'm hoping to get one right here as we're gonna get a gold it's a 73 okay but adding some of those players into the lineup not much has changed for the offense honestly the left side of our offensive line can get better and our wide receiver three with the tyler boyd now as for the defense we really need a middle linebacker and a right outside linebacker other than that the team is kind of solid i mean it's not anything special i could be grinding harder but let's go ahead and upgrade this jalen ramsey and actually i do not have enough training so let me go sell some of the players okay so there we go we finally upgraded the Jalen Ramsey to an 85 overall and that ends up bumping him up to the cornerback one and it's time for me to do some of these challenges which it's gonna take a while so I'll see you guys after that I mean we got legend challenges headliner challenges and the headliners forge challenges yeah this is gonna be a rough couple of hours like I said I jumped into the challenges and they took a little bit longer than I expected however we did end up completing a lot of our objectives that we had for example like the passing yards the daily challenges just simple ones like those okay so it is the next day and I finally ended up completing all all of these challenges now of course it's the next day so i have the aka challenges to do however i'm probably gonna save these for the next episode because if you guys look right here we do have 11 unopened packs to get into and of course the new aka promo just dropped today so honestly we could get pretty lucky maybe a playmaker pack or something pull an aka player just imagine how insane that would be but let's go ahead and open up this headliners welcome pack i'm not expecting too much from this i just ended up getting it from whenever i logged in a 78 kenny pickett that's pretty old but i'll take it now we do have four of these 74 plus overall headliner packs and i'm hoping to get at least 180 or maybe 84 overall or maybe we can even get an 87 i don't really know 78 not too bad of a card to pull and this one's going to be hopefully it's an 80 no another 74 and it's the same guy that kind of sucks but this one is going to be a 75 left guard but the next pack i'm going to open up is the legends fantasy pack we can choose four of each of these players and i think i'm probably going to go with franco harris junior Seau probably gonna go with Javon curse and then I'm thinking we probably just go with maybe Richard Sherman 78 overall so these are gonna be our four guys that we ended up going with however we do have the legends week two fantasy pack where we get to choose one of these guys it's gonna be Warren Moon and then Cam Chancellor which honestly at this point let's just go with Warren Moon let's get him a backup quarterback 78 overall honestly we could probably just end up selling this card for like 5,000 coins now from doing all those headliner forge challenges we did get this 85 overall Jalen Watson who who's actually a huge addition to our cornerback room. So I'm pretty excited about this card. Next up, let's go into this 80 plus overall headliner pack. I'm hoping for an 84, maybe even an 87 overall, 84 Tevin Jenkins. I'm not really sure. Do we have a right tackle? Oh my gosh. Okay. I just opened up the next pack. I don't know what this is. Okay. It's a playmaker pack. I was in the middle of talking, but I guess I just accidentally clicked it. And yeah, we're literally going to get absolutely nothing. But finally, we have a headliners forge fantasy pack, which I'm not really sure what this is, but we got it from also completing the headliner challenges and it looks like yeah 78 75 this isn't too great maybe each round will get a little bit better we get a 78 and then another 75 okay final round please oh my gosh a gold and then another gold yo they literally left the worst round for the last and if we take a look this is what the team is looking like after some of those additions obviously a big one being the right tackle tevin jenkins we also ended up upgrading elijah vera tucker to an 84 and also odell beckham jr to an 84 now as for the defense i mean we got junior say javon Kerr First, Jalen Watson. Our cornerback room is looking really nasty. I mean, I mean, we got 85, 85, 85, and then an 84 Julius Brents. But I'm thinking that I want to go ahead and finish this off by hopping into some solo battles, doing a couple of these, getting some more packs, adding some more players to the team. And I think that'll be it for this video. But yeah, I'll see you guys right after these solo battles. 
So it's actually been a couple days ever since I filmed the last video. And as you can see, I ended up picking up this 85 overall Reggie White from the field pass. This card looks absolutely sick and it's going to help us a lot on the defensive side of the ball, mainly with getting pressure. But we do have six unopened packs to get into. And most of these are headliner packs, but we do have like a campus hero welcome pack and a red zone pro playmaker pack as well. But let's go ahead and open up this campus hero welcome pack. Now this is going to be, I think it's the 79 overall RG3. And yeah, we got them. We can upgrade them actually. So I'm really excited for this card. Now next up, we have the 74 plus headliner player pack. Hopefully we get an 80 or above and we get of course a 74. Now I know we went through the AKA promo in this video and we also are going through the campus hero promo. However, I think in the next video, as we get an elite left guard, Ezra Cleveland, I think we can actually use this guy as well because I don't think we have a left guard. And yeah, it doesn't look like we have a left guard. We have a 75 and an 81 is definitely better than a 75. So we're going to be going ahead and plugging him in. But like I was saying, I think in the next video, we might actually go on a bit of a spending spree. I know that sounds pretty crazy. We're almost at half a million coins, but I feel like we really need to go on that spending spree in order to start doing more of the competitive passes, such as like the Mutt Champions and head-to-head -head games. That's just my plan. I don't really know if it's the perfect time to be spending or what to be spending them on as we get a left and 80 overall. And then we get a kicker actually. 78 overall Cairo Santos. I think we don't have a kicker on this account if I stand corrected. So that's a huge upgrade for us. And finally, we have this 84 overall B&D Headliners Hero Pack, which I think we're actually going to end up picking. Oh wait, no, never mind. You know, I was going to go with Kadarius Tony. However, we have some of the new Headliner players in this pack. And I really do use the tight end position a lot. And I think we might end up picking this Titans tight end. I really don't know how to say his name, but I really want to add him to the team. This is going to be a huge upgrade for us. So let's go ahead and put him onto the squad. So this is what I like to see. We're an 81 overall, and this is what the offense is looking like. Now we still need a wide receiver three, a left tackle. However, I'm really happy with how everything's coming together. We got a left guard upgrade from that pack. We also upgraded the Kevin Mawe. I think we upgraded him one more than last time. I'm not really sure. But as for the defense, we got some linebacker upgrades. Obviously, Reggie White's a huge addition for us. And for the special teams, we got a punter and kicker upgrade, which is huge for us, honestly. However, I think that's pretty much going to end up doing it for this episode. I think we made a ton of progress. We're almost at half a million coins. Maybe we might do a spending spree in the next episode. I don't know. Let me know what I should do. But with all of that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed and go check out my last video where I opened up some AKA packs. Now I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.